ready? You go first. Come on, chiggery. Chiggery first today. Where'd it go? Oh, wait, that's, that's only, it's only. Come on, my firstie. Come on, firstie. Chiggery. Hi, babe. I got, you go. Rocky, the squirrel, if you want one of these previous Critter Mealtime videos, I'll link to the playlist for my Critter Mealtime videos in the video description. Um, <clears throat> Rocky brought me another rock. <laughs> it was kind of like a hand, like in a, a mitten or a glove, or like one of their hands. They have like opposable nubs. It's not a full thumb, but it's like half of a thumb, but it moves like a thumb. It's kind of cool. And their feet swivel. You know, like maybe swivel chairs were like invented, inspired by the feet of squirrels. Hello, honey. Come on. Hi, babe. Keep coming, babes. You're very fuzzy. Oh, you guys have gotten your winter coats. How cute, how cute. Fuzz and eaters. Fuzz, fuzz the doors. got a tohi. We got two tohis. There's one. There's two. Hi, you guys. Sorry. Sorry. I think you put your food down. Sorry. So, happy critter meal time. Today is a uh, Monday. Yeah. Monday. It, was, it felt like a long week. Uh, Monday, uh, 30 October 2023. Tomorrow's All Hallows Eve. Halloween. And then after that, El Dia de los Muertos, which is like technically spends two days or like two calendar days because it's like the evening of November 1st or like the night. It's celebrated a lot. So it's like November 1st to November 2nd. But it's November 1st kind of thing. As I learned in Spanish class. So I'm thinking of going out tomorrow for a sweet eat. At Molly Moons. We shall see. I'm like, since a lot of places do like trunk or treat and stuff. So I don't, I concern. I was gonna do it today, and then I was like thinking through it, and I was like, maybe I'll just wait till Halloween. Conquer that, that's my part of my internal transformation. All right, it's doing stuff. Hey, you're back, or you say a different one. Um, doing stuff I did not think was possible. So conquering the fear of encountering trunk or treaters while I'm out there. Trunk or treat is like, People have cars and you like walk up and you get stuff from the trunk. I don't, that still sounds, I don't know. I haven't done that and I didn't do that as a kid. It sounds sketch. But then to some people going up to doors of like houses for people they don't know also sounds sketch. So to each their own. Come on, you guys. My parents got a box of like big full size candy bars by like, folding like regular, I think. So, if you come to this house, get a full size candy bar. We don't get a bunch of trick or treaters. That's historically been the case too. And when I was in high school, uh, I would get to give out the Halloween candy sometimes. And I'd be like studying for like a test or something. So, we'd have, I'd have the Halloween candy. And I'd be sitting in front of like a little space heater with the dogs. And I'd have my note cards and I'd be like studying for the exam and then have, you know, trick-or-treaters come in. As I would, and then I would take a break from studying, you know? So I was like, depending on how I was feeling about the test, it would be like, yay, trick-or-treaters are like, no, I just want to study. So 
interesting dilemma. And there, a little bit about me. Hello, beautiful. Lucky. Oh, so beautiful. You want it from me? Oh, hey. Love you. Another chicory. Two or three. All right, you guys. Bunch of stuff. Ding, 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 ding. It's a beautiful, if, if the weather is like tomorrow, like it is today. It's a beautiful Halloween this year. Yeah. Kind of cool. Good year to go trick-or-treating or trunk-or-treating trunk or if we're going based on weather and it is nice tomorrow as it is today. The rain's supposed to come back, what, not tomorrow but the day after. Whew. Running in, uh, I'm concerned today for my running uh, about getting too hot. If I wear my winter get up which I should be able to run in. it's supposed to be like 50 some when I'm thinking of running which is what I had been running in so I'm like I could choose not to or I could do half and half but I haven't decided yet I don't know it is nicer out at lunch time than it has been the past few days there's a Stella hi Stella hi you guys lunch is served ding 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 uh, and there's a dark eyed Junko that one. Is there another one? Oh, there's two. Second one. Here. Hi, Stella. We got the uh, the golden crown sparrows are back. We were out this morning. I was putting the food out and it actually it was, it was getting very pushy it was like come on food and came out uh, went on. look at you all perched beautifully on top of that bench oh and there's a bunny rabbit hi bunny rabbit And for my running, I mean my walk run. So, but yeah, it's actually it's warmer. Maybe I'll do. Hmm. I don't know. We'll see. It's a nice thing about doing these critter meal times with and with and without the videos. Uh, just getting out here three times a day, rain, shine, or snow. <clears throat> At least three times a day. It's nice because uh. I get an idea of what's coming at me, weather-wise, for my outdoor exercise, which is... I was thinking about that today, I was like, it's kind of cool, actually, that there's a feedback loop like that. All right, well, happy curl meal time, Monday, 30 October 2023. This is their lunch, and uh, it, it, we are in the community of Innisarden. City of Shoreline, King County, Washington State, United States of America, Planet Earth, the original. Happy day and time of viewing this whenever you are viewing this and happy place of viewing this wherever you are viewing this from.